Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys, as always. And you know what? I hope you're happy to be here with me too. As you can see, we have a new base design, guys, but this is not for my Town Hall 8 base. No, no, no. This is for my newly reached Town Hall 6. Guys, we already have all level 5 walls, um, which is awesome because level 5 is max for um, Town Hall 5, and since we are at Town Hall 6, we are doing pretty, pretty good. But what I'm going to do today is um, we are going to go ahead and um, raid. We're going to raid real quick. I'm actually going to build up um, an army camp for us. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Um, I'm just going to fill this up to 270 um, troops because we already have one that is completely full. Um, so we're just going to fill these up. Three, there we go. All right, and let's go ahead on the attack, guys, and then we'll get back to building this base. But welcome back to the second episode of Let's Clash, guys. Look at this. This is a perfect base to start off with. Um, I am not mad at this at all. Why don't we go ahead and drop down our giants right there just to get in there and take that out. Drop down a couple of goblins, some barbarians, and some archers as well. It looks like most of the resources are in these collectors right over here. Um, I'm going to try and distract this mortar right over here with these barbarians. Um, what the? Alright, so it actually, wow, it looks like most of the gold is up here in this corner, um, which is pretty annoying. I actually have some hog riders from Connor and my clan, so Connor, thank you so much for the hog riders. They're definitely going to help me get in here and um, take out that cannon so that I can um, get this gold right here. But I am definitely trying to um, three-star most of these bases just because I want to, just because I want to. <laughs> I want to be able to move up in the trophy range um, just to, I don't know, a point where I think it's good um, and I can get a lot of resources for my Town Hall 6. But right now, as y'all can see, it looks like we are about to um, get the majority of the resources on this base. Um, but guys, I'm super excited about this new series let's clash um you know everybody does let's plays and um, i've always wanted to i've always wanted to build up from um nothing to something with you guys i didn't start at level one because probably maybe one of my subscribers is at town hall level one for like one day so the whole point behind this is to help you guys get from whatever town hall you're at um, and move up in an effective uh, way using strategy and um, everything like that. So we're going to go ahead and end this battle because we got all the resources that we need. So that is awesome. Um, but the whole point behind this series, guys, is for you guys to join alongside me as I move up in um, in the in the levels. Obviously, I'm already at um, Town Hall 8. I'm pretty, pretty maxed out on that one. I'm almost um, to full max out on that. But... Uh, that one there isn't as, as much to do, and most people aren't at Town Hall 8. Um, a lot of you are at lower levels, so this is going to be for you guys. This series is for y'all. Um, but what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and put everything back here into this base. We are going to take one elixir storage and one gold storage, as well as a, um, as well as a mortar. And we're going to put it right in here. And then right here, what we have building is another mortar. We're going to set that right up here in the top um, so that the whole base is going to be covered by mortars. That's very, very important um, for any base, whether you're Town Hall 5 or Town Hall 10, is for your mortars to cover um, the majority of your base and help you out with that. Also, Clan Castle in the middle is very important. As you can see, it covers the entire base, um, so that is extremely necessary. Um, next, we are going to take this... Uh, elixir storage and we are going to put it right here um, across from the other one so that um, it's not on the same side as the other one so this way if people want all of your gold they're going to have to deploy on two sides of your base you want to make sure that um, people have to deploy as many troops as possible um, in order to take everything from you because you don't want to give them any freebies um, next we're going to bring in uh, this wizard right here then we have another wizard that is being built right here and as you can see, this one protects all of those resources right there, as well this one once it is upgraded. Uh, next, we are going to take an archer tower, put an archer tower right there, and archer tower right here. 
and then an archer tower right down here in the bottom. Um, guys, it's very important. It is very important to spread out your um, your point defenses, which are your archer towers and your cannons, just because you want to make sure that um, you don't put too many cannons or too many archers in one spot because um, they all have their benefits, and it's important to spread them out. So we are going to continue spreading all these things out. We're going to bring this over here. We're going to take our air defense, and I'm not too worried about the air defense um, being down here because really at this level, I'm not going to get attacked by that much air. I might get attacked by balloons, but I'm not really too worried about balloons, um, honestly. So I'm not too worried about that. As I just said, <laughs> we're going to bring in another gold mine and put that right in here. And then that's going to be everything for the inside of the base, guys. And then we are just going to bring around everything else, bring in these guys. Um, we're going to bring in our builders as well. Um, we're not going to leave them in the corners. I know that you might see a lot of people do that, but I'm not going to be doing that just because um, I want everything to be closed so that it can be covered. As you can see, this cannon right here covers that builder's hut, so nobody's going to get anything for free. Um, we're going to put our spell factory right up there, and then we're also going to spread out our uh, mines and collectors as well so that people can't just attack one side. As you saw on that other base, um, pretty much all of his mines and collectors were on one side, so all I had to do was deploy in that one area, and I had access to all of it. So our goal then is to uh, spread things out. As you can see, I have a gold mine, and then a barrack, and then an elixir collector. So uh, the attackers have to spread out all the way around the base um, in order to get everything that they want. We're actually going to bring this guy down here, um, and then we're going to scoot this guy over. And we're going to put this um, elixir collector right in there. And then we're going to put this one just right up here in the corner. Um, that way, as troops are working their way around, move this down, put this right in between. You can see it's every other right now. So that means that um, nobody's going to be able to just attack one side of the base and get all my gold, which I wouldn't want them to do. So that's pretty much it, guys. As you can see, um, I think this base is going to work really, really well. <laughs> really really well I am definitely excited about it I'm excited about this guys comment below on um, the kinds of things that you want to um, learn I'm gonna tell them to say hey to say hey to YouTube up oh, spelling new goodness um, alright so Really, guys, what I want um, from this is for y'all to learn. So comment below on the kinds of things you might have questions about um, dealing with the game, okay? Um, and I will try my best to answer them and help you guys out because, again, that's what I'm here for. I'm just having a good time uh, playing a game, and apparently you guys like it. <laughs> so um, as always, guys, I appreciate everything. I appreciate all the support. You guys are awesome. You're so much cooler than me. Um, and as always, guys, keep calm and clash on. And it looks like no one's going to say, hey, so sorry to everyone who's on, but you weren't paying attention.